A nurse told my mother that I wouldn't make it five years when I was diagnosed. And I would like to tell that nurse many things, but um, that she is very wrong, and it'll be eight years in October for me. My name is Hillary Quinkind. I am from Detroit, Michigan, and I was diagnosed with melanoma in October of 2004, three weeks before my 18th birthday. When I was diagnosed, I was already stage 3B. That's pretty far along. So they assigned me to Dr. LaRusso, who works in the phase one clinic. I've learned so much from Hillary. Um, oh, yeah. I love you. She's taught me a lot about life. And her mother has helped me with strength in understanding what it's like to be a mom of a patient with cancer. You saw Piggy? My family comes to every appointment. They're my biggest support system, and my biggest fear is is leaving them if things don't go our way. So how's it going, Hillary? It's going okay. How was yesterday? Yeah, I stared at myself for like 45 minutes. It's just, I mean, I'll even, I'll just do this. And, so that's what I look like now. But you're beautiful. <laughs> Thanks. If I were to not continue treatment anymore, like I know nobody can put how much time you have, but do you have any idea, like a range? So if you did nothing, my question to you is, how much time would you want, knowing that you can't have all the time <laughs> in the world anymore? Oh, gosh, a year? Probably not. I don't know that we would have a year. Bungee jumping, ride in a hot air balloon, meet Dave Matthews, skydiving, and get married and have children. Well, it's basically my bucket list. The odds are not really in my favor, but I just keep going, keep fighting and something great will come of it. So maybe if it's not me surviving, maybe they'll find a cure and I will help. Hillary can leave a legacy, not only being part of this experience for Stand Up To Cancer, but letting the world know that anybody can do something to help make the difference. And hopefully one day, maybe there will be a cure for Hillary Kind, because patients like Hillary Kind have volunteered to help make that difference. Tis the gift to be simple, tis the gift to be free, tis the gift to come down where you want to be. And when we find ourselves in the place just right, twill be